Hi, Jared Volley here, creator of the Faster and Funnier Stand-Up Comedy Course. If you're trying to learn how to write observational humor, then the first thing you need to do is always keep a notepad with you so you can always take notes when they happen. Don't think that you're going to remember a joke long after, you know, the, the night after or even a week after uh, you're, you actually made the observation. You have to get it down right away. And there's a very specific reason for this, and that's because as the, the further along, the further away from an observation you get, the more the brain generalizes that idea. And I could uh, prove it to you this way. Think about what did you do uh, last week today? So seven days ago, what did you do? Think about, think about it, and you're going to come up with a very general answer of probably what you do on every day, uh, on every one of those kinds of days. However, if I was to ask you, what did you do yesterday, or what did, I do, what did you do today, then you'd be able to come up with some very specific answers to that. And if you're an observational comedian, if you want to write observational humor, then you need those, those weird nuances in order to not come out as really hacky. Because if you try to write your humor right in front of a computer, so you're trying to think of observational jokes in front of your computer, then the only thing you're going to be able to think of is you know, hacky subjects, subjects that anybody can really think up uh, uh, you know, just sitting in front of their computer. So you have to be uh, walking around with a notepad that is ready to go whenever you actually have that, that weird idea that you want to pursue. So that's going to help you be very specific in the ideas that you get when you actually sit down to write. And then once you sit down to write, you're just going to be fleshing out that, those observations. You're going to be asking yourself certain questions that lead to expanding your material. And we go over those, those questions a lot in uh, our stand-up comedy course. You can find that at creativestandup.com.